This video is going to show you one route for updating your Skyward password using Hello ID. There might be other routes to get this done, and if there are, and you figure out a different way to do this, that's awesome. This is one way that works, but it is a multi-step process, and you've got to follow each of the steps super specifically. To start, we're in Hello ID. We're going to find this Skyward tile. We're not going to click on the link, though. Instead, you're going to move your mouse over to where you see this gear icon, and you're going to click that. Then you're going to click Delete Credentials. And then we'll hit Delete Credentials for Skyward Family Access. Now, we're going to actually click the link. When we click the link, we're going to be taken to a page that's going to ask us for our credentials. We just deleted them. So right now, I'm just going to do this. I'm going to write Test right here and Test right here. You can really write whatever you want here, but I'm just going to keep it real simple. Test and Test. Continue to Skyward Family Access. When I click that, if my browser asks me to save that, I don't want to save that password. That's not my real password. So I'm going to close that. And it's going to give you an error saying they're unable to validate the information. You're going to click OK. And now you're going to be at the Skyward page with this login ID and password that don't work. You need to click Forgot Your Login slash Password. You're going to click that, and then you're going to enter your email. For students, this is first.last at student ssd.org. So first.last, just like how you'd log into a computer, and then the at sign, student ssd, like Snohomish School District, dot org. Then you hit submit. After you hit submit, you can actually close this window. Now we're going to go back to Hello ID. You're going to then click Outlook. Outlook is your email. I'm not going to click it because this video is public and that would bring up all my emails. But you're going to click Outlook and you're going to go and you're going to see an email come in from Skyward. The email is going to have something in the subject line about resetting your Skyward password. Inside the text of that email, there's going to be text that says your Skyward username. You do have to read that email. And when you read it, one of the things it will say is what your username is. There's also going to be a link, and the link will be to help you reset your password. You're going to click that link. It's going to take you to a new page that looks kind of like Skyward, where it'll show, I believe, your username, as well as a place for you to think up a new password and enter it and save it. When you click that and you're done, you're set. So now what you get to do is remember that password you made, and then you can reference the email that's in Outlook for your username. We're then going to go back here to Skyward, and we're going to click that little gear icon right there. You're going to enter the email that was in your username, your Skyward username, and that's not your first dot last. Check that email carefully for what your username is. Your usernames for Skyward are kind of wild. So you're going to enter that username for Skyward, as well as that new password that you just made, and then hit save. And if all of that works right, every single time you click into Skyward Family Access from Hello ID, it's just going to automatically input your password and shoot you straight through into Skyward if you follow all these steps. If at any point it doesn't work and you need to repeat the process, you can also always do delete credentials, delete, and just repeat this process remembering to, so I'll do it again, test, test, go here, don't save it, get denied, and then this is the key. If you ever lose your password, forgot your login password, then using that email to reset it. And then saving those credentials to Hello ID using the little gear icon on the Skyward tile.